I. EFT is a very very effective cleansing tool. It can be used for any kind of blocks that we have in our life. Blocks that have been limiting us. In fact, the founder of EFT, Gary Craig, specifically deals with physiological as well as emotional blocks. He wants to treat patients having psychological disorders or disorders that are related to the psychology of people. Then there are EFT masters like Carol Look, Patricia Carrington, who are treating other blocks that people face in life. They could be any blocks. They could be blocks related to money, blocks related to relationships, block uh, related to any other kind of limiting beliefs that we have. Now, when we are trying to use EFT to unblock ourselves, to resolve the problems that we have in our subconscious, then we will have to look at it from a very in-depth point of view. I would like to discuss certain secrets of applying EFT effectively. Now the first secret that comes to my mind is to use EFT in the beginning for simple problems. Mind you, when we are trying to learn the protocol of EFT, when we want to use EFT in our lives, we should not directly jump at reasons that are very very serious because there is a lack of acceptance in the minds of people regarding EFT. People many a time think as to what tapping can do to them but tapping is a very effective tool and I feel when we begin applying EFT we should begin applying it to simple problems first so that we can experience EFT. So I think the first secret of applying EFT is to apply it for simple problems. It could be any simple problems. It could be that you are not organized. Yes, that could be a problem. It could be you are unable to do your daily exercise. It could be you are unable to control a particular craving. Probably you are unable to uh, control eating sweets or whatever. I think these are the small and simple problems that we need to apply EFT and see how does it change our lives. Do we change by using the EFT protocol? So, when you first identify simple problems that you have, any simple problems, start with the basic statement protocol, use this hand, the karate chop point and just tap saying that even though I am unable to get organized, even though I am unable to organize my work, even though I am unable to attend to my work in a very organized way, I deeply and totally love and accept myself. I think this is what you need to do when you tap this point for three times. You have to say the statement for three times and after that make a short statement and just tap these points that I am not organized, I am not being organized, I am not organized, I am not organized. I am unable to organize my work, I am unable to take care of my work, I am unable to take care of my work in an organized way, I am not organized, 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 I am not organized. That's all. Just tap for two or three times and just forget about it. Mind you, in this protocol, I don't Feel the need for you to gauge the subjective unit distress scale. Because these are so simple problems. They are problems. But they are simpler problems. I don't think you need to gauge. Because many a time people are unable to gauge the distress. 
In this case, because the distress level is not very high, I don't want you to go into that protocol too. Just use a particular problem that you are facing. Just think of that problem and just tap. I think you should do it for a few times. See what happens. Tap twice or three times in a day. See what happens to the problems that you are addressing. And if you do it with a lot of patience, and with a lot of sincerity, I am sure you will feel the difference. And once you start feeling the difference, then sky is the limit for you because then EFT will just make you free. I will now talk about other secrets in my coming videos. Till then, keep watching my videos. Thank you.